Hello everyone, this is Ninja Girl Sucker One here back with my Neo The World Ends With You Let's Play. Last time, we finally finished up the first week. We hunted down and took on Shisakichi, defeated him. Pretty good fight, I guess. But uh, fortunately, us winning did put Deep River Society in last place, and they were erased. And on top of that, our team was still disqualified because at the end, we did get a little extra help, which is apparently, quote unquote, against the rules. So, we had to participate in the game again. So, yeah. But, before we do start the second week, I need to say thank you so much to everyone who has helped me and my family over this past week. I'm sure many of you wonder where videos were. There was just. Some really intense stuff going on in my personal life. If you've been following me on Twitter, you know what's been going on. And I just, I want to say thank you to everyone. Because what you did has greatly helped out a lot. So, thank you so much. But yes, it's time for me to get back to work. Try to not let any of this stuff get to me. And just try and have some fun. And you guys deserve content, after all. It's the least I can do. So yeah. But, here we go. Let us start. Week 2. Day 1. Yep, let's go. Again, this is New Game Plus, so my team is a spoiler. Didn't want to know. Yeah. Avoid the video for now. Wait till you finish later on. If you have the game yourself. Which, buy it! I'm gonna keep, gonna keep trying to promote this game, because it does deserve it. Gonna try to promote it in my own little way. Go out and buy it. Greetings, sheeple of Shibuya. Hello. Got some red hot news for you. The game has begun anew. Big surprise. Say goodbye to your points, cause you're back at square one. Uh huh. Can't wait to see who gets the fire started first and keeps it burning. <laughs> Although it feels like the top team has already been decided. Go ahead and prove me wrong. If you can, that is. Hey, guys. Hey. Greetings. Boy. Only four teams they sure sound upset. Can't blame them, though. <laughs> the Ruin Bringers. Ugh. The Pure Hearts. The Varia Beauties. Hey, Conan. And the Wicked Twisters. And that's us. You have proven yourselves worthy with powers beyond compare. But I wonder, can you handle a little extra heat? Do we have a choice? Like Sriracha? No! Don't think so. Missions that will bring your brains to a boil. Oh and boy. And noise that'll leave your body singe within an inch of your lives. And things will just keep getting hotter from there. In other words, more difficult. Oh. The temperature's gonna keep rising, players, will you? I don't believe I was speaking to you. <laughs> You're starting with that already? <laughs> you shouldn't be surprised, Fred. Well, you've seen what happens when you fall. Yep. You face erasure. So start sizzling, teams, because the game is underway. <laughs> and with that, I bid you adieu. Adieu. Oh, boy. I bid you adieu. Give me a break. I know. We're screwed. We barely made it through last week. How are we supposed to survive if this week's even tougher? By doing our best. Especially without Lord Tomonami fighting. Oh yeah, Binamimoto ran really off. For good. Then we're really screwed. Nothing left but to face Erasure. That explains why Fuya panicked when they fell into last place. Yeah. He knew exactly what was coming. Yeah. I think I mentioned it last video, but in case I did not. Obviously, this is Rindo, Nagi, and Fred's first time playing the Reapers game. Now, if you've played the original, you know what Erasure meant when they were talking about it before. But them seeing Fuya disappear, along with, I guess, his whole team, Deep River Society, they were erased. Literally meaning erased from existence. They are completely gone. Yeah, and that's the consequence. If you lose the Reapers game. So, yeah. Now they know what that means and how bad it is. So that's why they're a little oh god. Hmm. Hey Rindude. 
We can't go out like that, too. Yo, Rindo! Huh. What? I was just thinking. Yes, Fred. remember that guy? Which guy? The one from yesterday. The guy who saved you? Oh. What did Suzy K call him again? Neku or something? Come to think of it. Neku? Yeah. Suzukichi seems somewhat fearful of our mysterious savior. Takes a lot sure to scare that guy. Too bad he didn't stay longer. You don't think he's another player, do you? He definitely didn't seem well, like a leader. More like a masterless samurai. Maybe he's looking for a team to join. Wait, you don't want to try to recruit him or something, do you? He could. Try, but there ain't no guarantee he'd accept your offer. Oh. Hello. You again? It sounds like Neku's piqued your curiosities too. I can't blame you. City wouldn't be standing here today if it weren't for him. God, I still can't believe he is Joker's voice actor. I'm not kidding you. This guy has the same voice as Ren slash Joker from Persona 5. It's hilarious. Damn, seriously? Wait a sec. Remember how Candyman told us about that legendary player or whatever? Think he was talking about Neku? Yep. Candyman. Oh, you mean Karia with the lollipops. Kid's pretty proud of his city. Wouldn't surprise me if he started throwing around big and fancy words like legend. Strictly speaking, he never used that exact turn of phrase. He didn't? Huh. Close enough, right? But what about you three? You think you can hold your own without your buddy to back you up? Have we any other choice? Exactly, we don't <laughs> have a choice. No. no. Yep, Anyways, nope. Uh, best of luck with today's mission. I've got a feeling you three are gonna need it. Uh-huh. <laughs> be tough with no one around to pick up your slack anymore. Uh, we can pick up our own slack, thanks. Or at least try. It's a real shame, though, after you've made it this far. Oh, it's almost enough to make a Grown Reaper cry. Sure I'm it is. You three, so keep things entertaining for me, will ya? <laughs> Dang. I know. Almost enough to make me cry. Shall we proceed with the day's mission, Lord Rindo? Might as well. <laughs> Lord I Rindo. We ran into a legendary player. I still I like I that. <laughs> look at him yesterday. Things are looking rough for us without Minami Moto. But maybe this Neku can help us turn things around. <sighs> Wait a sec. What about Swallow? Good question. Hey, you still alive? No answer yet. Investigate the alley? Uh... Makes two of us. Okay. Let's see. Mm. Yes, yes. Break the barrier and erase the target. Okay. Yeah, I do want to answer here. What do you have? Anything good for style? Style plus four. That's pretty good. Ooh. Jay Dice? Ooh, mint flavor too. That's pretty good. Oh, and that's new. That's defense plus six. But only style plus three. And honestly, style is so important. I, I keep mentioning it, but it really is. You really need it, because, again... All the abilities that you get with your team, they are tied to the threads that you can wear. And if your style isn't high enough, you cannot use that thread's ability. So, yeah. The more style, the better. I'm not level grinding right now, so it doesn't matter if I, you know, stuff us to the brim. And now we We're still in ultimate difficulty, that's remember that. Really no special more. bonus. Aw, Rindo didn't like it. Neither did, uh... That character. <laughs> Trying not to spoil it. Anyway. Hammer angles. <laughs> oh. Damn, it won't open. And that's not gonna change until this guy quits leaning on it. Maybe this is the barrier we're looking for? Shouldn't there be a reaper around here? If there is, then they're well hidden. Either way, want to get through this gate? We're going to need to get this guy to go somewhere else. Uh. It certainly appears we will struggle to proceed without his cooperation. Ugh. be a hell of a lot easier if we could just give him a little push. 
This heart seems free from the noise influence. Come on. Noise is influence. Hey, cool dude. Come on. Think of this gate. Huh? Something about this gate bugs me. It's working, it's working! Yeah, right. right, he uses remind ability. <laughs> it's metal and and holy. Oh wow. Like a gate. But it's also shaped like a door. Like, which is it? <laughs> Whatever. Time to go back to chillin'. Aw oh, man. Hey, good good try, Fred. Good try. I remember there was another gate behind us before. But it wasn't shut tight. If I didn't see anyone around, we could unlock it. If we want out, this way's our best bet. Just need this guy to lend a hand. Mm. Sounds about right. But how can we get him to help? Agreed. Perhaps we could try imprinting him with an idea? Yeah, I guess. Let's look for something we can use to make him open the gate. Now. Again, because this is New Game Plus, I already have the words I need. But, yeah, you're supposed to go around and talk to all these people and get their keywords. That. See? Fascinating. Right. You get the general idea. This isn't the first time in the game we've done this now. But I no longer have to because I already have the words. Um duh, Tasty. Or wait. I think it's um We'll try. There. Time Try that. Change your mind. Time to change your mind. God, this game is such style. I love it. There we go. Hmm, yeah. I could go for some tasty pancakes right about now. They do all... They do say sweet tastes best when you're tired, after all. Here we go. You know, I came all the way out here. I ought to treat myself to a stack of fluffy pancakes while I'm in the area. Also, uh, it's Mr. Mew on his, uh, hoodie. Not to shiki. Time to quit playing games and get in line at the pancake place. Hey. We did it! It's finally open. Curious. Which grants us access to... This whole area. Cool. Oh! Takashita Street. Would have never guessed from that alleyway. The mission can't already be over. Can't? Guess we did break a barrier. Well, that still leaves our target. Let's see if we can find them. We may as well. <laughs> Aw. Yeah, we can look around now. Let's see. Yeah, obviously the Reaper's where we need to go. I just figured I'd look around. Oh! I wonder if there's any new fashions that I'd want in here. Probably not. Hey there! Hey there! Oh yeah, this is a pin shop. Yeah. Nothing I really want. Catch you later, alligator! Catch you later, alligator! <laughs> that was nice. Any other shop I might want to take a look at? Not really. Alright then. Let's get to work. I do wish Rindo had a... Well, he does have a beat-up thing. <laughs> Hello. Hmm? You kids sure took your sweet time. You sleep in or something? Not exactly. Hang on. Are you saying that the gate wasn't part of your missions? A uh, gate? No, sounds like you three just have terrible luck. Or one of the other teams played a prank on you. Huh? But why would they do that? Well, there's what? Four teams left now? <laughs> Makes sense. Some peeps would smart eh, would start getting desperate. Anything to slow the competition down, eh? Aww. Even resorting to such base tactics? After your after your performance yesterday? No wonder people are scared. Yeah, because we beat Sisakichi. I mean, if it wasn't for that technicality, you kids would have had the room bringers beat. Yeah, the technicality of somebody jumping in to help when we didn't ask them. Oops. Uh, actually, scratch that last part. I probably said too much. Anyway, you want to pass me? You're gonna have to solve three riddles. Really? Yeah. Right, tell. What might they be? 
or what what they might be. Yeah. Oh, I ain't got him on me, princess. I just sold the brass. You kids finally showed up. No. Yeah. You just got a message. Just, yeah, you got a message just now, right? Everything you need to know is in there. Thanks, I guess. They sent us three links in here. Each one probably contains a riddle. Lord Rindo. Lord Rindo. Which shall we view first? Number one. Hmm. Just an order. It don't matter. Let's check out the first one. I think I remember this part. Clothing shop. The door will open when the mannequin reveals its stylish side. I am utterly confounded. What on earth could stylish side refer to? A stylist or something, maybe? Oh, how about a model? Really? A mannequin that moonlights as a stylist? It's me. Might have something to do with Storm Shibuya? Could be. Ah. Let's look at the second one. Oh yeah, this one, I think I remember. The key will reveal itself overhead when the vending machine takes the six designated digits. What's it mean? What's it mean? We require designated digits to conjure a key above us. So it'll just appear out of thin air? Beats uh... me. And doesn't six numbers feel like a lot's put into a vending machine? Yeah. Well, let's just keep an eye on the sky while we walk around. And the final one. Hmm. Capture differing poses with your comrades in a photo sticker. Was that right? Yeah, wow. Wouldn't it be photo booth? This journey shall serve as your key. Well, I know what a photo sticker is at least. But what's it mean by journey? Perhaps. As it refers to today's journey. One would assume we ought to tackle that riddle last. <laughs> Agreed. Huh, good point, boss. What? I mean it. I meant it. <laughs> well, thank you most kindly. Let's come back to this one later on. Alright, let's get started then. At least we know more or less what we've got to do now. But something tells me we aren't going to get very far without exploring a bit first. Agreed. Okay, so... Oh? This isn't looking good. We've got more slack to pick up than I thought. Wallow hasn't even read my message. What if they're on Fuya's team? Does that mean they got... Erase? Nose. Hey, Ren Dragon, thanks for checking in. I'm okay. You're alive. What about you? Hanging in there? They can't be playing the game with us. Right? Unless... That would mean they're either with the pure hearts... Air beauties? Still stuck playing this game. To be honest, it's really stressing me out. Just want it to be over. Oh no! I take it you didn't beat the boss? No, it was cheap. Dang. What are you up to now? Trying to recruit someone to help us win next time. Oh, nice. Got anyone in mind? Yeah, kinda. Got to find out. Hey, Swallow? Hey, Rin Dragon. Lol. Can I ask you something? Whoa. Ahem. Huh? huh? Dude, were you even listening to me? Uh, no. Sorry. Let me guess, Swallow. Oh, actually, yeah. So, where are they? I, uh, haven't asked yet. Jeez. Then, what's the point of talking to them all the time? Why the hell do you care anyway? Because, in case you haven't noticed, we're kind of in a bind here. <sighs> oh, do you think your friend Swallow can come help us out? I'll take that as a no. It's fine, whatever happens, happens. Nothing we can do at this point. So you're just giving up? Uh-oh, did I catch you at a bad time? Oh, hey, Kanan. <laughs> Hello, Haru. <laughs> Say, Fret, I could use a few words of encouragement. Care to help? Um, your alpha today is fierce? 
Aw, you almost sounded like you meant it that time. Really? Wait, seriously? What a bummer about last week, huh? You three came so close, only to lose on a technicality. Yeah, something like that. <sighs> Would they had only let our victory stand, I could be enjoying the new chapter of Elestra right this very moment. Well, just be glad you didn't get erased. You've got another chance to win this week, right? Yeah, if you say so. Hey. By the way, I was meaning to ask you. What? Have you heard anything about a new player joining the game? Wow, you sure got your finger on the pulse of the city. Actually, we saw him with our own eyes. He jumped in to save us, and then he just disappeared. Sounds like you caught a lucky break. I wonder who he was. I think Shisekichi called him Neku or something? Apparently, he's this legendary player from a few years back. Neku, huh? I've certainly heard the name before. Guess he's more legendary than I thought. <sighs> you weren't thinking of scouting him, were you? Oh no, like I said before, it's not worth the risk. Wouldn't want to ruin a good thing, right? So, what do you three know about this Neku? Nothing really. <sighs> not but his legendary status. Same here. All I've heard is that he's the one who saved Shibuya from total disaster. Yes, he did. Total disaster? Wonder what happened. Yeah, and of course, Neku also helped Sora. Sort of. <laughs> in Drain Drop Distance. I wish I could say I was still... I was still in the RG back then. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I think it was, a, it was pretty awful, though. So this guy was here three years ago. But where is he now? Gone without a trace. Mm -hmm. Nobody's heard anything? Not a word. As much as I'd like to believe he's the one who came to our rescue the other day, or came to your rescue, sorry, I get the feeling he wouldn't show up unless the entire city were in peril. Ciao. Anyway, thanks for the chat. Ciao! <sighs> I know she said we should be glad we didn't get erased last week, but who's to say we won't this week? Let's go find Neku. Huh? Whoa! What's with the sudden surge of motivation? You don't stand a chance with just the three of us. I mean, you're not wrong. And you're thinking Neku can carry us to victory then? Do you have a problem with that idea? <laughs> I never said that. I don't know. I just don't think it's feasible, especially not after what happened yesterday. Like, what's the point in playing if the game is rigged, you know? But hey, we can go looking for this Neku if you want. You don't have to come if you don't want to. You know? I didn't say that. Whatever. What? I literally just said we can go. <laughs> Ahem. In that case, shall we proceed with the mission? Fine. Here we go. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Sometimes fun to do that. Sorry. Okay. So we need to solve the riddles. Um, let's see. I feel like there's an alleyway that I need to make my way into. Ah, yes. Thought so. Reaper symbol. Hey, this vending machine has a Reaper sticker on it. Indeed. It must be possible for us to purchase refreshments from it. Look. There's some weird drinks in there. And each one's got its own number. Hang on. Amy, this is the vending machine from the puzzle. Uh... Oh. So we just need to go ahead and enter the magic number. Are you speaking to me? Obviously. I imagine your hypothesis is most likely correct. <laughs> For real? Then, all we need to do is find out the mystery number. Oh, I can't do it yet, really? Ah. This mannequin's a little undressed, huh? Or underdressed. <laughs> Gotta admit, it sure knows how to rock a birthday suit. Uh, I uh, guess you could say that. Perhaps. Could this be the very mannequin we seek? Though I must say, I expected it to be more challenging to locate. Right. Well, assuming that it is the one we're after. What are we supposed to do about its stylish side? 
Tis a valid question. I can agree. Oh yeah. Hello. What do you have? Out of curiosity. Need something. What is this? Oh, do I have that one though? What about this one? I don't know if I have it. Does it say anywhere that I have it already? Oh! That's a good ability, actually. Hello! Yeah, what about this one? Oh, oh uh, that's not bad, actually. That's not terrible. I feel like I have that one, though. Do I even have what I need to trade for it? Yeah, I do. If I have it, I have it. That's pretty good. Or no, I must not have had it, because it would say sold out. Okay, good. Cool. I don't know if I'll use it, but I probably won't because I have really good pins. But there you go. That's something you can buy. That's pretty good. Aha. What? What do you think the crowd's for? Maybe there's a celebrity in there. Hey. Was that seriously? Kashiki over at Croaky Panic? Hey. Wait. Like the Kashiki? Sure look like him. How about we go and take another look? Huh? Wait a sec. That's Hanoka over there. Oh my god. She is so much cuter in real life. Totally. Ugh, I would kill for a body like that. Her face is to die for too. Trendy only hires the cream of the crop after all. Hanukkah, please marry me. <laughs> oh. So they're all here to see Hanukkah. Hanukkah, huh? Honoka. Looks like she's registered as a model on some fashion site called Trendy. And is idolized by millions of teenage girls. Fascinating. Would certainly seem to be the case. Famous for her on fleek fashion, she Hey! Hey Rin dude! You think she got she's got something to do with our riddle, you know? Fashion? Could be. Let's try and get a closer look. There must be like a bajillion girls in this crowd. I can't get a good look. But there were only some way to dispose of these onlookers. Not a bad idea. If we find something they care about even more than Anoka, that might just do the trick. Yes, it would. Hello. I, I love that. Quit. That has to be a reference to Chocobo. It has to be. Maybe it's unintentional, but it certainly seems like that. <laughs> hey, get a load of her. What about her? Something about her feels awful familiar. Familiar how? Like she reminds me of someone, and you'll never believe who. Although it could be totally off base here. Hey. If only there was some way to find out if I'm right. Mm -hmm. How about you try scanning her? Oh, great idea, buddy. Yeah. I mean, I never promised it would work. Now he's coming curious. Maybe I'll give her a scan too. Why not? Ooh, a blue monster. Is that one you get a re Yeah, that's gotta be another one you get a report from. Stay calm, Kashiki. No one knows it's you. That guy just now totally thought you were a girl. Man. I ought to thank my makeup artist for teaching me how to beat how to beat my mug so well. I've never heard that expression before. <laughs> Holy crap, I was right! Looks like our boy Kashiki's gone incognito. Actually, this gives me an idea. I mean, he is number one on trendy right now. Number one on what? Their monthly ranking of dreamboat actor. And he got all dolled up so people wouldn't recognize him? Makes sense. I mean, you heard how those girls were gurgling over him. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
if we remind them about Kashiki, I bet they'll be here in a heartbeat. That would help us get a closer look at Hanoka. Fascinating. You would have us expose him to the thirsty masses? <laughs> Sounds pretty cool when you or cruel when you put it that way. <laughs> I never said that. Well, we could make those girls stay by giving them a chance to a chance encounter with Kashiki. And he'd probably be there. And he'd probably be more than happy to meet with big fans like them. Don't know how happy he'll be, but we've got a riddle to solve. So if Kashiki's here, just have to get those girls over here too. I already said they saw him, so we only need to remind them that they did. Yeah, that's that's an encounter you can get a uh, report from. I already have them. Again, I will read them all to you when we're done with the main story. Let's have a look. So yeah, Gotta focus. let's, let's remind them. Every time I see these puzzles, I'm reminded of Life is Strange. <laughs> Primarily episode three, for obvious reasons. There we go. Come on. Speaking of which, February. For getting the HD remaster and I'm very much looking forward to it. I want to see how different it looks, if at all. Alrighty, that should do the trick. Now we simply wait for the herd to begin their migration. A minute now. Let's see if they're ready to move. Huh? Kashiki's here? Are you serious? I'm like... 86% sure he was he just walked past us. I've had enough of Hanoka anyway. Let's go find that dream boat. Great. Oh, I can't wait to ask you to marry me. Oh boy. Fan girls. Damn. Pretty face is a powerful thing. Fascinating. I must admit, that girl appears to be quite stylish. Ooh, she is pretty. Yeah, that's gotta be Hanoka. Wow. She's as cute as cotton candy. You say so. Wait, I don't get it. What's her style got to do with that mannequin? Perhaps we are supposed to make the mannequin resemble her in some way. Could be. Oh, whoops. Wait, what if we make the mannequin wear her outfit? How did it skip that? Whoa, you're giving me chills, Rin, dude. That's genius. Agreed. It's certainly a plausible solution. All right, let's have a look at that mannequin then. Will do. Okay. All we gotta do is match her outfit. It's mannequin. Must be the one mentioned in the riddle. Looks like it. In that case, I presume we ought to clothe it like that model. Is it uh really okay for us? Okay for us to play dress up with this thing? No one's looking, pal. And hey. They couldn't see us even if they were. They'll just notice that it's makeover later and be like, Oh, fierce outfit. Mm. Guess so. Come on, let's give it a shot already. Mm -hmm. Gotta pick up Hanoka. That's all we need. All right, all right. Okay. So, let's start with the beanie. That looks right. Mm. Yeah, this definitely matches her outfit. Hey, you know I've never gotten this wrong. Okay, and the jacket... I wonder what happens when you do. Probably just, oh, you're told to do it again. This looks okay, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, does he say the same thing each time I pick something? Fair enough. Okay. Ripped up jeans. Mm -hmm. Okay, please be right. Success! What do you know? What of truth. Mannequin has revealed its stylish side. You have solved the riddle! Phew. Yeah. Well, that's one riddle down. Time to move on to the next. Hey, what about that bag Hanoka was rocking? Kinda weird we didn't need to put that on the mannequin, don't you think? I mean, that thing tied the whole outfit together. And it was pretty cute, too. Yeah, again, it's Mr. Mew. Gato Nero. Uh... Just me? Different strokes, I guess. Mm -hmm. Guess so. Well, good.
Why is there a mark still there? I think that happened before, too. Okay. Fascinating. Why can't I? Uh... I should be able to do it. Right? <laughs> I can't do that one yet? Really? Why? Aww. Yeah, there she is. There's something I'm missing here. I thought I'd be able to do that riddle by now. Really? Do I have to do this one first? It said to do this one last. Hey. What do you say, Rindu? Would want to try it out? Nah. Yeah. What? Why won't it let me go do this one? Oh, did I have to go and come back or something? No, it still says the same thing. Uh... You let me do the puzzle. Let's have a look. Okay, yeah, they're all over here. What do I have to do? I don't know why it won't let me do the... Oh! Here? When do you say that this screen is overhead? Tis an accurate depiction of its position, yes? Her position, yes. Correct way to say that. The key will reveal itself overhead when the vending machine takes the six digits... Six de eh, designated digits. But the only thing is, her feeling is static. It normally shows all kinds of ads and stuff. It must be broken. It means we gotta fix it in order to solve the riddle. But how? You don't have to do anything, my dude. Look over there. Oh? A repairman. Such matters are best entrusted to a professional. Shall we wait for him to perform his handiwork? Yeah, hopefully it won't take long. How come? Not doing anything. Maybe he's not here to fix the screen? Uh -huh. Or perhaps the problem lies elsewhere. Like where? Uh -huh. Within. Of course, within. Within what? I believe a scan is in order. Right. All right. Let's see what's up with this guy. Gotta focus. I can't believe it. How could she dump me after an entire decade together? I even said I'd forgive her for cheating on me. What a sap. Oh. <sighs> wow, that's pretty rough. Yeah. <sighs> Such anguish must be a great burden to bear. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hang on a second. That's just a noise talking, right? He'll meet someone new eventually. It's not the end of the world. Uh, right. Come on. Let's dive in there and help him out. Uh -uh. The mere thought of entering such a mine is enough to make one quail. Really? At least give it a shot. Besides, it's the only way we can solve the riddle. That's true. Very well. I shall carry on my duty, but I shan't enjoy it. However... Let it be known that whatever happens within is no responsibility of mine. Okay. Relax, it'll be fine. Let's dive. Onward I dive. Pardon the intrusion. <laughs> Pretty funny. Okay, I'm on ultimate, so let's see how bad this goes. If I start really struggling, I might just turn it back to normal difficulty. Uh-oh. Increased damage. I know, because of the red screen. Oh no! It's okay. We have our God on Euro stuff. We'll be okay. I am pretty high level. I have good equipment right now. Yeah, okay. We're fine. <laughs> you just never know. Brace yourselves, everyone. Round two. HP drain. So does our yeah our HP contribution. Figured. Come on. Whoa. Gotta keep going. Did 
nice one. That worked out easily. I'm glad I haven't had to turn the difficulty down yet, but... Party is equipped to win. Never know. <laughs> oh no, these enemies. I hate them. They're horrible. Luckily, my... Got a Nero Pink and freeze that fool. Easy win. Okay, that was good. Very good. The wicked twisters are hey! And we got a gold rank. Sweet. Again, there is a trophy for doing 15 dive missions. And getting a gold rank. Pretty good. Whew. Looking back. I guess we'd been drifting apart for a while. Now it's time to throw myself into my work and forget all about her. There you go! All else fails. Glad that's over. Indeed. Huh? Ugh, it's not over. The screen's still busted. Come on, dude. Do your job. Fix the thing. Now, now, Fret. Don't rush him. Oh? Lord Window, look. It's working. But what's all that supposed to be? Just looks like a bunch of shapes to me. Maybe it means something. There's an arrow going from the triangle to the number three. Eh? And how many sides does a triangle have? And there's six shapes in total. Think this could be a clue to those digits? Once we've got to enter into the vending machine? Oh yeah! You went beyond to something, Rin dude! Anyway, let's make a mental note of all of this. And head over to that vending machine. Uh. Sounds good. Yep, let's move. And Nami Nami Moto. First off than I thought. Why we need Neku, we gotta find it. Alright, so yeah. I think you get the idea with this puzzle now. I just hope I remember everything correctly. But it's pretty easy. This is our vending machine. Mm. Now we must input the six numbers using the digits next to the drinks. Goes. Careful, Rin dude. Mess it up. I won't. I'm not you. <laughs> oh, that's harsh. Okay, so a triangle has sides. Five. Four. That's technically a square. It's just a diamond. One, two, three, six. Four. Zero. So this works. I think I did it right. Hey. Something came out. Yes. First try. <laughs> it's pretty easy, but you know. <laughs> the number of corners in each shape served as our solution. Yep. Yeah, it's pretty obvious. But I'm also a dum dum sometimes, so I could easily mess even that up. I admit it. As expected. Success! A message has arrived. The key was revealed. After the vending machine took the six designated digits. Mission accomplished. Uh. Man, that would have me stumped. But you two got it? Uh, Fred. I'm terrible with puzzles and stuff like this. And I figured that out. But then again, it, it it's pretty... Let's go knock out the next one. Yeah. Be nice if we had some time to look for Neku, though. Oh, you're still set on recruiting him? We could really use someone like him on our team. Yeah, we could. Yeah, but who knows if he'll join us, let alone if we'll even see him again. Yep. It's all good, though. Come on, Riddle Master Rindo. We've still got work to do. Right. Although the last one's very... Oh, I've been gone 44 minutes already? Nice. Goes. Well, look who it is. Oh, hey, Candyman. What's up? Yeesh. What sucked the life out of you, kid? The whole search for Neku thing isn't treating you too kindly? It's treating us fine, I guess. So, something else is weighing you down? It's just... This game isn't exactly easy, you know? Oh, now what? Mm. Incoming. Greetings. You again? Greetings, sheeple of Shibuya. <laughs> if it isn't the conductor himself. 
this is your ma this is your game master. She was speaking. Master game game master. Uh, hope you've been having fun on day one. Got some red hot news for you. Oh boy, can't wait to hear this. <laughs> one team has already completed today's objective. Well, did that light a fire under the rest of you, slow pokes? If you can't stand the heat, then it isn't the game for you. The temperature's gonna keep rising. Will you? Adieu. And with that, I bid you adieu. Adieu to you too, buddy. Tell me, Candyman, do you Reapers like what you do? Like it or not, a job's a job. Feel me? How come? I do, but like, what's the point? What do you get out of forcing people like us to play this game? Hmm. You got an inquisitive streak in you, kid. I dig it. We're not doing it for our own enjoyment, that's for sure. So then why are you doing it? Think of it this way. <laughs> the game's like one big talent show. We're looking for the best and the brightest the RG has to offer. They get sent here to play the game after they die. We evaluate their performance and see who comes out on top. Make sense? Yeah, but what happens to the top players? Some of them join the Reapers. Some of them rise even higher in the ranks. But why would they do that? And why, and what might those higher ranks even re entail? Management mainly. Somebody's got to watch over the city, right? Not everyone sticks around, though. Some folks just go back to their lives in the RG. In the end, the winners get whatever they want. So it's not about how many points you earn. It's about proving how tough you are. Right. But I'm not talking you as a team. I'm talking you. Maybe you ought to focus a little less on Neku and a little more on yourselves. But if our team wins, then that means each one of us wins, right? And if we can recruit a strong player like Neku, then wouldn't that increase our chances of winning? You don't say. Huh. I suppose you got a point there, kid. No need to make yourself shine in some if somebody else can do it for you. Although, I don't think they had that in mind when they started this up again. Eh, anyway, you kids got a big week ahead of you. How do you how you survive is up to you. Just make sure you do. Laters. Bye. Yeah, again, he was in the first game, so he knows who Neku is. Man, we're really in over our heads here. I have a dreadful feeling our odds of returning home are ever dwindling. Nah. Let's not lose focus. We've got two objectives. Find Neku and figure out the rest of these riddles. Yeah, yeah, I hear ya. Uh. We've already solved the first two riddles. All that's left is the one about posing for a photo sticker on in today's journey. Mm -hmm. Whatever that means. Well, our wanderings today have been restricted to Takashita Street. First, we open that gate, which wasn't actually part of the mission. Then we got bombarded with these three riddles. Uh... Huh. I feel like there was something else. Something we saw over and over. What the heck was it? Oh, and think. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. We saw a bunch of Gato Nero stuff. Yeah, we did. Right. All right. Now that you mention it, I do recall witnessing Mr. Mew many times. Perhaps we are meant to draw inspiration from him for the riddle's poses. Oh, I never thought of it like that. Yeah, it's definitely worth a shot. Let's start by heading to a photo booth. So, Mr. Muse are Mr. Mew, see? <laughs> oh, Mr. Muse. I get it, yeah, huh? I mean, unless you have a better idea. Yep. Nope, so photo booth? Photo booth. Mm. Yep. Shall we? Yeah. Let's move. And that, I believe, was... Yep, right over here. Uh, we'll capture all your best angles. Sure. Here, photo booth. Where one can acquire photo stickers. And there's a Reaper sticker on it. Uh... I bet we can use it to solve the riddle. Yep. Let's try imitating the poses we saw Mr. Mew doing today. Mm-hmm. We saw him on that honey, that wallet, that bag, and that drink. 
But there's only three of us in four pictures. Huh. I guess it doesn't matter as long as you choose one. Pose for the camera. So, who wants to do which pose? How about we do rock, paper, scissors to decide? Yes. It is a fair methodology. I have no qualms with it. Now let's go. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! <laughs> Alrighty. Purses. Well, shall we? Do we have an option here? Say cheese! Your photos were picture perfect. Great job! Just gotta wait for him to print. We'll capture all your best angles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Said that already. They're done. <laughs> that is pretty cute. <laughs> well, we did what was. Oh, I got a message. Success! Differing poses from today's journey were captured in a photo sticker. And the key was revealed. Tis over at last. Man, what a shot. I mean, just look at your faces. Look at your face. <laughs> now that it's over, I'd rather not. <laughs> Doggy is hilarious in this photo. I love it though, it's cute. That's all three riddles solved. Um, now we just gotta report back to the Reaper. Where was he again? Mm -hmm. Near Tokyo Plaza? Oh, right. Well, let's get moving. Yeah, off we go. Yeah, he was just over here at the end of the street. No biggie. Let's move. Hello. Let us through. What's up? Oh, hey. Looks like you solved all the riddles. Way to go. Here you had it in you. Yeah. Toki Plaza is now open for you to enjoy, however your hearts desire. You could go shopping, eliminate the target, even though the Ruin Bringers already beat you to it. <laughs> what? Yeah, but don't let that stop you. You can still have your fun. Just won't get as many points for it. Really? Yeah, come on, we've gotta hurry. Yeah, I guess the more opponents that take it down, less points we get. Bad. Need as many points as we can get right now. As all the points we earned the previous week, like was mentioned, they're gone. Fascinating. Right. Ooh. Let's see. What is around here, huh? Gotta go this way. Someone's over here. Hello. Ah. Oh yeah, it's you. I remember this now. Think that's what we're looking for? Pretty, pretty targety to me. Which means the brawl is about to... It's all but unavoidable. Jewish Minami Moto were here to help. But he's not. So we'll just have to handle it ourselves. Right, let's go. I remember dying to this thing so many times on my first playthrough. Because I was a lot weaker. But now... It's time for my revenge. <laughs> This thing is going down. I'll bark and no bite, I'd say. I'll bark and no bite, I'd say. I don't know. I'm still an ultimate difficulty, but I think I'll be okay. I want my revenge. Come on. Nice. Hey, let let me go. Oh, whoops! Ah, I meant to press X, not circle. No. That's what I get for not playing in a while. <laughs> I took the week off. And that's what happens to me. Oh well. Glad I'm not dead though. <laughs> I'm shredding through. Good. I deserve revenge. You're a chameleon, but you're not a nice one. Ow! Well, I don't know how you're supposed to dodge that attack. How you're supposed to get out of his that his sight. I guess just you're supposed to dodge roll like that or whatever. But yikes! First playthrough, I he got me good. But haha! -ha! 
Got you on ultimate difficulty. I'll take that. Sweet revenge. Noise erased. Ooh, and I got a star ring. Surprise, surprise. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> nice. And I got her finishing screen. Cool. I really like it. Very nice. I'll take it. Rin, dude! The target! Hello! Uh, mm. It appears she holds a pin in her hand. She does. Which serves as a reward for vanquishing the day's target. Darn! Huh? They're in! Having slain today's target in record time, the ruin bringers start on top. Wait, you're with them? I am Tsukumi Matsunai, a ruin bringer. I think she's also the character from the Another Day. <gasps> Seriously? I thought you'd all be a bunch of beefcakes. Like you know, the, the new addition guy. to yeah, Final so, Remix. Right? I think. So, Tsukumi, did you take down that noise all by yourself? Yes. Wow, impressive. He's staring at me. Uh oh. <laughs> yes. Have we met before? I don't think so, but <laughs> it definitely feels like we have. Who knows? Is this a staring contest? <laughs> Do you two know each other? Is she that swallow friend of yours? Huh? No, I I don't think so. Right? There's no way. What's this? Today's mission wasn't enough for you? <laughs> you wanna go another round? Doka! Hey there, Shoki Doki! Doka John! If you're trying to start a fight, I'll allow it. Somebody's gotta keep things interesting around here. I love her. You, sweetie. Goodbye. I love Shoka so much. Hey, hey, wait up! She's amazing. She's gone. And I was just about to grab myself some popcorn. Aww. Glad you're having a good time. <laughs> Are you kidding? It's a laugh riot. <laughs> I mean, you completely bungled your way through day one. And you got point sniped. Oof. Did you just come to make fun of us, or...? As if. I'm here because it's my job, dummy. Well, we're <laughs> here, so you can leave now. Oh, You know, maybe I should grab that popcorn after all. I love her sass so much. <laughs> I, she's she's fantastic. Since you're so salty. Oh! <laughs> ha ha. Hey, come on, Rindo. That was good. That was a good pun. And what about Neku? Did he swoop in to save your sorry hides again? Sadly, no. Huh? How do you know about that? Everyone knows about that little stunt, sweetie. So, did you see him? Yeah, sweetie. Everyone knows. Nope. Not today, at least. Huh, bummer. Well, my work here is done, so I'm out. Bye, Later Shoka! Losers. Later, losers. Speaking of that line, I have seen on Twitter that, I think I mentioned it, but I will mention it again, people are complaining about the localization and trying to blame that for the reason that it failed, that the game didn't sell all that well, or as well as Square was hoping it would. No. That has nothing to do with it. And there was even an article that recently came out talking about why she would say later losers instead of something else. Um, I forget what she says in Japanese, but it's not later losers. It's something else. Wish I remember the exact wording. It might just be something similar like goodbye or, you know, I don't know. But... In Japanese, it kind of is the same context as this. And the reason they changed it to Later Losers, aside from it flowing better and giving her more character, is because, well, the Ruin Bringers are her losers. You know. Because she's kind of been guiding us a little bit since the beginning. Sort of. You'll see as we get further into the game, but yeah, it's just... Yeah. The translation is great. And I love Later Losers. It's it's great. It gives her such character and such sass, and I love it. More than she already has anyway. But yeah, it's great. I love it. 
is my point. What'd she bother coming here for anyway? She, like her fellow Reapers, seemed particularly concerned with Neku. Which means they're probably gonna start bothering us for information. Maybe. They've already started. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah, Kanan asked and then she asked. Man, I can't believe the Ruin Bringers are winning from day one. What was Sugi Woogie's deal anyway? Sugi Woogie? She looked like much of a fighter. She is a most peculiar case. A creature of the light who aligns herself with the darkness. That sounds almost Kingdom Hearts like. <laughs> The fluffy familiar she kept at her side was equally intriguing. Ah, yeah. Dang. She barely said a word and you've already got a pretty good read on her. I don't believe I was speaking to you. Ah, <laughs> uh, right. My bad. Has this fool developed a resistance to my attacks? <laughs> There's something about that girl. I can't put my finger on it, but she seems different. And I can't shake the feeling that I've seen her somewhere before. Her face is so... Familiar. Yeah, I swear Dugumi is the character who appeared in the Another Day or New Day, whatever it was called. The new content that was in World Ends With You Final Remix. The Switch one. I think that's her. And I haven't seen that content, so I have no idea. One day, maybe, maybe if the original is ever ported to PC and my computer can run it. If her psychic prowess is on par with that we'll see. of Kiji, she's formidable indeed. Then let's hope they're just a two-man army. I don't want to imagine <laughs> any more of them. Yeah, I can understand that. Right. Yeah. Aww! Hey, hey! Hi, what a fabulous day! She's cute. I love the pink. I'm just tickled to be back in the lovely city of Shibuya! I think she was in the first game, too, yeah. But, there's no time to waste. I still have oodles to do- What the hell are those ugly-ass pins? Hold the phone! Are those player pins on living people? Gross. Wow, I'd love to know which of those slime balls came up with that little scheme. Oh. That's a kind of a reveal. Ahem. Anyway, like I was saying, I still have oodles to do. After all, my dearest, darlingest friend needs my help. Uh, if only someone would come help this poor little fairy princess. Seriously, I ain't got all day here. Clock's ticking, pal. But that's talking about, huh? New game, chapter end. Here you go. Well, that was the first day of week two. I hope you guys enjoyed that. But I think, like I've been doing, I'm ending the video here after each day is done. So, yeah. Once again, I want to say thank you to everyone who has helped me and my family this past week. I'm forever grateful. You guys are incredible. I appreciate it so much. You have no idea. So does my family. Thank you. Once again, if you follow me on Twitter, you know what I'm talking about, but yeah. I don't need to go into too much detail for those who don't. It's, yeah, it's a rough situation. My family is kind of in at the moment, but just thank you so much for all your help. Everyone who has helped, you know who you are. Thank you. But yeah, like I was saying, I'm going to end the video here. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, share around if you want. If you want to follow me on Twitter or support the channel on Patreon, which I'd be forever grateful for, both links will be in the video description below. And yeah, next time, we will move on to week two, day two. Until then, see you all later.